My name is Andre Rosset. I've been working in distributed systems lab at uh, UT Dallas. And in this lab, we work with uh, this uh, test bed, which allows us to run uh, wireless tests without interference. So it's, it's a wired test bed. Um, what I have been working on in this lab is on this uh, environment monitor, which is used to tell conditions in the room. It, it tells the temperature, whether the lights are on. It also tells you whether um, the door has been opened and if it's from the inside or outside, the door was open. So it, can, it gives you a rough idea if people have been there and if they went out of the room, how many people are in there, you can make an idea. If the air conditioning malfunctions, for example, this will tell you the temperature is higher than normal. It will allow you to go in and, and uh, resolve the situation, for example. And you can check this from the internet. It posts to Twitter. So you can see like every hour how everything's going on, if the lights are on uh, certain times. Um, you can also tell if someone came in like in the middle of the night for some reason. This program allows incoming freshmen, mostly incoming freshmen, to um, participate in the research, which usually only uh, graduate students get to participate in. And it gives us like an experience with how to work in the lab, how to develop a project, how to work on it. And, uh, it also allows us to get an experience of college before actually getting in, making a great group of friends before the madness of moving day and everything. I'm planning to major in computer engineering. So this has definitely given a good, a positive experience about what a computer engineer does, which is to integrate hardware with software. The first main uh, goal of the Clark program is to get them, get the scholars into uh, meeting people in their departments. Uh, not only the research professors, but also uh, uh, support staff and all the administrative assistants, etc. Grad students, postdocs, everything. Um, such a key in their future here is determined by rec letters. And we believe that the sooner they meet professors, the sooner they start building on these rec letters, and the stronger their rec letters are uh, that help them move on to med school or other professional schools.